sports now. The Golden Knights have advanced to the Western Conference Finals for the second time in three years. But getting past the Canucks was quite the grind. John Treach is here now with Vegas on a rest day. John. Now imagine playing five of the most grueling hockey games of your life in seven days, only for the reward to be pressing restart and doing it all over again against the Dallas Stars. That's the Golden Knight reality in the Stanley Cup playoffs. Game seven was hard fought and glorious for the Golden Knights, but it is in the past. The Golden Knights and Dallas Stars both played the maximum amount of games in the Western semis and nearly were eliminated. They survived and are thankful they don't have the wear and tear of travel, but that doesn't make the quick turnaround easy. Game one is tomorrow, whether a team is ready or not. You know, I, I think everybody would take a night at home uh, to, to get away from the environment in order to clear your head. I think that's always healthy between series. Uh, you know, unfortunately, you know, we don't have that, so you've got you've to deal with the, the mental piece of that and try and get away. Uh, some way mentally, you know, today we didn't do anything. We didn't host, we didn't host any meetings. We didn't show any video. We just wanted them to, to clear their heads, uh, you know, as much as they couldn't here. And this just in for the NHL, the Knights will be without Ryan Reeves for game one as he is suspended for last night's illegal hit. Coming up in sports, coach Peter DeBoer gets into the Dallas matchup, plus the Raiders make a few roster cuts that hit close to home. Sasha? 